Glory be to God Almighty. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Depends on the country where you are watching us from. This is the journey so far live on ATN Radio. We are also live on AP Radio UK. We are also live on Kingdom Radio 94.9 FM. God bless you all. Thank you all for joining us today. Thank you all for always being there. I don't take this for granted. We have a wonderful, a great minister in our midst today. I will definitely bring in our guest today. Our minister today is no other person but Minister Tosi Oyelaki. After a short while, I'll bring him in. Stay with us. We'll be right back. God bless you. From that short break, the only spirit by Minister Tosi Oyelaki. Minister Tosi Oyelaki, she's a woman of God, a woman filled with the spirit of God Almighty. Wow, I can testify to that from that song. Amen. She's a minister, a multi award winner, a mother, a wife, career woman. Welcome to our Miss Minister Tosi Oyelaki. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me. I'm so blessed to be here with you, my minister. Um, God bless you. And God bless you, everyone that is watching or listening to us today. Thank you for joining us. 
Wow, that's awesome. That's Minister Tosi Oyelaki. Mm -hmm. To our viewers, who is Tosi Oyelaki? Well, um, to put it short, in, in short, <laughs> Tosi Oyelaki is a beautiful, you know, blessed daughter of the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. She has a big brother whose name is Jesus, who died for her, by the way. Mm -hmm. But thank God, Father replied to him. <laughs> And yeah, so, <laughs> so my big brother loves me so much. He just, you know, he decided he was going to die for me. And, you know, thank God for that. Mm. And yeah, so, um, and because of him, I am here today. So um, who mm. I am and what I am by the grace of God, I'm a gospel singer. I'm a, you know, I'm, I'm a songwriter. I'm a worship leader. I'm a minister of the gospel. Mm -hmm. I write, you know, daily devotionals. I write, you know, um, you know, general about life and about, you know, things in the scripture and the, the will of God for our lives. And I teach, I preach, I, you know, support people. I am, you know, a physiotherapist. I'm in the, you know, health sector and also see that as a ministry because the Lord, you know, commissioned us to go into the world and heal the sick. So I believe that's part of my ministry as well. Um, the ministry of healing and yeah, leading people to Christ generally through my music, my teachings, everything that I do. Wow, 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 more than five, six things <laughs> combined together inside one boat. You are very strong. Glory be to God Almighty. Wow, yeah. Um, on this program, we talked about the journey so far, and today. We are here to talk about the journey so far of your ministry. Are you yeah. able to combine all things together and still win the challenges and everything you encounter? Being a minister along the way, are you still moving? What keeps motivating you to keep moving on the journey? These are what you are going to discuss today on this journey. So to start with this, how did you know you had a call to the ministry? Um... To be honest, I didn't know until, well, I always felt drawn to the things of God from when I was very, very little. I was always preaching on my way to school and back from school. I was always preaching on the bus, in the taxi. Me and my younger sisters, we would sing and preach in, on the bus and in the taxi or on the way to school. We'll just stop people and preach to them. You know, we didn't know much about what we were saying, but... Just to say, Jesus loves you, you know. <laughs> he wants to bless your life. You need to be born again and all that and all that. So I, I was always drawn to the things of God. Um, so I didn't know that, you know, I would have like a, a professional ministry. I just want to serve God in church, praise and worship, you know, and back up when I, I'm called up to and lead worship when I'm called to. But um, until, you know, 20, about 2014, when, you know, um, I was going through a very difficult, you know, situation in life and mm. I received a song that helped me through that situation. And I just, you know, wrote that song and I thought, yeah, this song has helped me through this, you know, um, situation. And but God told me then clearly to go and record the song um saying go and record this song i need you to put it out there because there are people it's not just for you there are people who are going through the same thing you're going through and they would you know benefit from from the message of the song and it was god just talking to telling me you're precious that's all you know that you know i was precious i was beautiful those were the songs that god gave me at that time and i recorded mm -hmm. them and i thought you know that was the only one that i was going to ever do because i i wasn't writing at that point well, having done that, God just opened like a wow. floodgate of songwriting. And I just was kept, you know, kept mm. writing, kept writing. And yeah, that's it. <laughs> yeah, that's how wow, I started. Wow, wow, wow. So precisely, you started the journey um, of ministry in 2014. Uh, well, I wrote that song precisely. in 2014, but I released it in 2016. So it started actually professionally. Wow. In 2016, yes. 2016, <laughs> yes. That's awesome! Wow, more than it's more than that year in the ministry. Honestly, <laughs> in fact, wow. If I may ask, from that, from that 2016, how has been the journey? 
from that 2016 up to this present moment, has there ever been a moment of challenges <laughs> ever since that time? Yeah. Uh, that's 2016 yeah. up to present moment. Yeah. Uh, there's been long has been the journey. Yeah, it's it's been a lot of um ups and downs. Okay, so there have been a mm. lot of challenges. There is no way you can want to do the work of the kingdom of God of light mm. without having challenges. If you are not having challenges, you need to check yourself. <laughs> like, am I actually mm. doing the work of God? Because even that's our true. Lord Jesus promised us, He said, In this world you will face trials and tribulations. And he that would yeah, do walk in, in righteousness, we will always face challenges. So, I mean, since I started, there's been a lot, a lot of challenges. But the one thing I can say is that God is faithful. Every challenge, He has mm. given a way out, He has given miraculous way out so there have been you know lots we faced a lot of obstacles a lot of um opposition a lot of you can't do this a lot of you're not good enough a lot of rejection you know and but god mm. has you know strengthened me throughout throughout or even all of those so I, I i i thank god that he's helped through all the challenges there have been challenges definitely mm. challenges in the area of ministry or challenges of life it's not generally. It's like the devil is throwing everything and anything. So it will challenge life, family, children, um, finances, you know, That's work, true. even at mm. work. There were challenges at work, you know, in mm. church, challenge in church about, you know, um, church, you know, relationship. It has been a lot of challenges. So it's challenged everything, mm. even the ministry itself. Is challenged. I mean, um, for example, mm. this I thought just a few months mm. ago, um, from between July to October, in fact, until last month, I can't sing. I couldn't sing. Hmm. And I couldn't talk to you the way I'm talking now wow. because the enemy attacked my voice. The doctors prescribed a lot of medication. They did all sorts of tests. They couldn't, it didn't work. So I thought my singing career was over just this few months ago. So, I mean, I lost my voice completely. I just, even to talk, I was croaking. <laughs> so, I mean, but, and it took wow. months. Wow, Normally, wow, wow. when you lose your voice, it only takes a few days, you know, of treating it and everything. But mine took about four, five, mm. almost, yeah, nearly six, well, from July to October. You know, it was about three, four months. So, I mean, mm. but God healed, you know, completely when it was his time. Glory be to God Almighty. So there's been challenges even on the health, on the body. Wow. <laughs> you know, yeah, the enemy has challenged the Lord. I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy for you that the Lord restore back your voice. Nothing can take that voice away because that Amen. voice is glorifying God. Exactly. <laughs> it's an instrument for God. Exactly. Nothing can take it away in the name of absolutely, Jesus. Absolutely. Yeah, I'm only joking. <laughs> yes, oh it belongs God. to God. You are using it to glorify Hallelujah. God. So nothing yes. can tamper with it. Amen. Yeah, Glory to God. Well, Amen. Uh, welcome, everybody. Uh, just joining us. This is ATN Radio. We are also live on AP Radio UK. We are also live on Kingdom Radio 94.9 FM, Sweden. And our guest today is Minister Tosi Oyelakin. It's been a wonderful time with her today. So we are still sure when if you're just joining us on this program. Shortly before that break, woman of God, I know there's been a lot of a lot of challenges along the way. But if I may ask you, what keep motivating you to keep going on this journey? What mm. keep motivating you to keep going? We are here to learn from one another. We are here mm. to use our stories to try others, to bring others to to win souls for Christ. Mm. There've mm. been a lot of challenges along. The yeah, a lot. But what keep motivating you to keep going on this journey, despite I mean, all? The yeah, I mean, I can say the only. I mean, I was when I was introducing myself earlier. I talked to you about my big brother Jesus, who died for me, and that love that That's took true. him to the cross. You know, the love of Jesus mm. that took him to the cross for me as a person. You know, because if I was the only person who needed to be saved, he would have died all the same. So he loved me like wow. there's no other. Just the same way he loves everybody 
like there's no other person. So it's that love of Christ, you know, that he showed mm. to me. And not just the fact that he went to the cross. I told you about challenges. Even before I was doing ministry, life was a challenge. But every step of mm, the way, that's true. showing me love, he keeps fighting for me, delivering me. I can I see his hand in my life every time. Do you know what? Mm. Nobody has done for me what he has, what he's, what he's done and what he's doing. Nobody has stood by me. Mm. Nobody has shown me love like that. And I can say that, you know, categorically and boldly say, I have never felt loved with anybody like I do with my father and with Jesus. And so Thank who you, else Jesus. will I serve? If not mm. him. Thank you, Jesus. Given me a gift Thank you, Jesus. And said to me, go and use this gift. Yeah. And he said, to him, go mm. and use this gift. And if he's shown me so much love and he said, I will be with you. Nothing can harm you. You go, I will, wow. you know, cover you. Where, what else will I do? But go as yeah. he has said to me, you know, and as he gives me utterance, as he gives me strength, and he, as he opens mm. the door for me, I will go. So that's my motivation, the love of Jesus. Wow, wow. the love of Jesus. I love that. And he's the greatest. His, his love is unconditional. When he say go, he will definitely back you up. No yes. matter what challenges that won't come your way, once he say go, and you obey yes. him, he would definitely back you up. Back you up. Wow. Yes. Our oh, minister Tosin, before this program, mm. I've listened to many of your songs. Your songs are spirit filled, Amen. they are original. Amen. Honestly speaking, I've listened to many of your songs. You're really trying in the industry. I must say that before, the, before this program, I've listened to many of your songs. How do you get your inspiration? <laughs> I I don't know. <laughs> it's the Holy Spirit. You know, um, we said they would say, mm. Oh, why I was going through challenges, like yeah. the, you said the first song, yeah. you receive it through um maybe the the situation where you found yourself at that time, yeah. maybe yeah. during the challenges, yeah. you receive the first one. Mm. You know, some we yeah. said um why I was ministering to people, mm. God revealed himself to me. Mm. When, while I was sleeping, God gave me this song in mm. Revelation. Mm. Why I was doing this, you know, different people received different yeah. I mean, ministration on different different area. So how do you receive your songs? Is it through Revelation? To people or going through some certain things I mean, I mean, I, I receive songs in many, many different ways. Um, but mainly, mainly, I mean, the first one I was, was telling you about. Can you hear me, Minister Timmy? Can you hear me? Yeah. Okay, all yeah. right. So I mean, I mean, the first I one I you. told you about, yeah. Um, I was in my sleep, you know, because I was going through this situation mm. and my flesh had magnified the situation that I couldn't hear God in my waking moments. Mm. So God had to reach out to me when I was sleeping and when my flesh was completely at rest, you know, that let me just give her this song. It was like God was singing that song to my ears. And I woke up, you know, hearing your pressures in my eyes. I made you with my mm. loving hands. Because what happened to me made me feel like everybody... You know, I was like a hate, uh, the most hated person on earth, the most unwanted, hmm. the most unloved person. But God had to tell me in my sleep, your pressures in my eyes. I made you with my yeah. loving hands. I will never let you go. And you know, that song, <clears throat> the words of that song, even hearing it today, is over five, ten. Sorry, I wrote it in 2014. So it's been over seven hmm. years since I've had that song with me. And it still blesses and you. It still blesses me, even. <laughs> You know, anytime yeah, I'm yeah. feeling rejected, dejected, like mm. you know, things are happening, people are doing what I just go back to the song and I say, I am precious. I'm you know, I am again. precious. I am wow. precious. God loves me. Jesus. If nobody else yeah. loves me. So I received that one in my sleep, you know, when I was mm. sleeping and I woke up singing that song to myself. So when I, I heard him sing his beat, and then I returned back to him and I said, I'm precious in your eyes, you know. So I, 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 now, I now, you know, wrote this song fully. 
I wrote my own, you know, response to God saying to me, you're precious. And wow. yeah, and beautiful. The other one, I was just in my bathroom encouraging my little daughter then. She was, I think, um, hmm. seven years old. You know, she was feeling sad. Even I was going through that situation. It was around the same time. And then I was telling her, you're beautiful, you know. And I, I, I was saying that to myself as well as her. And then hmm. as she was walking away, I just started singing, beautiful, that is what you are so beautiful. Um. You oh, know, uh, <laughs> and you know, <laughs> so, we are so pressure in his sight. Yeah. So honestly yeah. speaking, <laughs> yeah. So oh. those two songs actually, you know, work together. So it could be, I, I, I'm talking to my children. You know, the, to, today mm. I wrote a song. I was talking to my daughter. She was saying, you know, mommy, you make a song out of everything, and you know oh, what? I wrote a song out of that. Yeah. <laughs> Wow, great. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so just this afternoon, I've written another song because she said to me, You're always wow. making a song that I said, Well, that is wow. why I'm at my life. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. I'm, I'm so sorry crazy, for you, know? honestly speaking. Yeah, so, wow. so it's, it's really a blessing, <laughs> honestly. It's really a blessing. Once you obey the voice yeah. of God, the yeah. rest is just second, honestly speaking. Yeah, Once you yeah. obey Him, whenever I say move, you move. Whenever I say stop, you stop. It's a second. You say seek for the kingdom of God and its righteousness. Every other thing shall be added. Once you obey his voice and, and just yield to his voice, the rest is just secondary. Wow. I'm so excited that you're such a blessing to the body of Christ, honestly speaking. Even your, your brother, he will be rejoicing and say, yes, I gave him that gift and he used it wisely. Yes, Even yes. to keep your fire, honestly. I praise God. God for your life. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Lord. Yeah. Minister Tosin, like I said earlier on, I said on this mm. program, we are here to talk about the journey so far of yeah. your ministry. You are in the ministry. You are still moving. I know mm. God is your mentor, but apart from God, who is your mentor on this earth? Who is your mentor? Um, Do you have any mentor? I don't have any that is that mm. we have um close one-to-one -one relationship. I, okay. I have people that I you know talk to and who can encourage please me. Please with you. I'm with you, please. I'm with you. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Please okay. go on. Okay. No problem. You. So I have people that I talk to. Uh, you know, encourage me, and that you know, if I'm if I need sort of guidance on on something on issue of life or anything, I can talk to them, and they will sort of you know, we can all you rub minds as you know they say iron sharpens iron. But also, I I look up to a lot of um, musicians from afar who are not you know close to me in terms of we've not we, we never have met be, met before. So um, people like, um, I love C.C. Winans, for instance. I've followed her, her music, you know, since I was a teenager, I've always loved her music. So she's somebody that inspires me a lot. And her songs always reach, you know, the depth of my heart and my soul. Um, so that is that is C.C. Winans. I also, you know, love, um, um, I love Sinach. Sinach is somebody that inspires me. The Lord is using her in a very great way all over the world. And you know what? I mean, for somebody from Nigeria to be making such rich as she is doing and making so much, you know, um, impact in the name of Jesus all over the earth. Mm. I think she inspires me too, you know, and, and, you know, I just pray that the Lord continue to use her in that great way and use more of us that like that, because if there are more of us, you know, taking the gospel to the ends of the earth like that, the name of the Lord, yeah. you know, will be, will be trending yeah. everywhere. Yeah. Every day, you and know, you. And, 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 oh, yes. yeah. so oh, I mean, yes. yeah, yeah. <laughs> wow. That's so great. Like so in other words, you are inspired by great, men and women of God in the industry, that's in the it. ministry. Yes. Glory be to yes, God that's Almighty. Right. Yes. I can I can see that. I can feel that for even from your from your speech, even from your song that yes, God is at work. You know, when yes. God bear you, he fully surround you with Amen. people that we that we energize I'll keep keep you moving on the journey. You understand? Right. So whenever I call, we can never leave you alone. Those he called, he Amen. empowered him. So Absolutely. when he called you, we never leave you Amen. alone. He must surround, surround you with people that will all 
please right. gear your spirit up. Even why you want to feel as if you are alone, God will mm. always demonstrate with it, demonstrate to you that you are not alone. I'm always with you, and that is who God is in our life. If you are That's joining right. us, this is ATL Radio, and our guest minister today is Minister Tosi Oyelaki. We are about to hear Mr. Tosi's song now. The title Shama by Oyelaki. Be right back.
Welcome back, Holy Spirit. Wow, 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 wow. What a wonderful song. Minister of God, yeah. congratulations. Wow. Thank you. I just Thank wanted so to much. talk briefly on the inspiration behind one of these two songs that we just listened to now. People yeah. talk about the inspiration behind any one of them, please. Okay. So Holy Spirit um, is a song, mm. another song that, you know, came. so this one came in a very unusual way for me. So mm. I was going through a really, another difficult time. This was end of about 2019. And it was, mm. you know, not end of 2019, it was sometime in 2019. And it, the pressure on me as a person has never, is something that is affect that was affecting me really and i just needed a respite from the holy spirit and i was I, I was asking him you know that the holy spirit should just breathe on me should give me his peace through the situation that i was mm. going through and at the same time a brother i have never met him before is somebody that met me i met on on, on instagram has been following my music and he says I write songs, you know, I've written a song and I would like you to be the one to sing it. I don't sing, but I need, you know. So he, he sent me the song and it was a Yoruba, you know, song um, about a Mimimo, you know, um, you know, a Mimimo, and please open the way. That's how he said it. So I listened to the song and somehow I connected with the song and I thought, you know, I actually really like this song. So he, he, I took the chorus of the song that he gave me and the tune, and then I made it into English and then changed the words to, you know, what you hear today. But, you know, basically, the insp he, mm. he was inspired by the Holy Spirit and to give it to me. And then mm. the Holy Spirit that inspired me to write the song and make it into what it is today because it was just the prayer I'd been praying at that time. And then he brought me that song. And, mm. you know, it was just an amazing way that the Lord reached out to me with another person writing a song that I could actually make into, into my own. So that's how the only, I was inspired to, to, to write that one, to be honest. And it's, you know, it's a song that asks for the Holy Spirit. We just need him. We need more of him every day that we yeah. live. Yeah. We need his power. We need his yeah. blessings. We need his refreshing every time. And especially when the enemy is throwing, you know, so many things at us, you know, we need him. We need him, basically. Yeah. Wow. Great. That, that song is awesome. Honestly speaking, it's a song that never, in fact, it's a song you can listen to over and over and over and over again, honestly speaking. I, I would love to continue on this program with you, but because of our time, I can honestly speak it. I've overspent the time oh, now. Oh, thank you. But if I may ask, where can people get your song, please? Okay, so my songs are available on my YouTube channel, which is Toasting Where You're Lacking YouTube channel. Okay. Um, they are available on Spotify, on um, Amazon, on um, you know, iTunes. They're also on um, Audio Mac as well. Um, so they're, most of them are free to download. You know, most of them, you can get them to download for free. Um, yeah, so I have a new album out as well, Your Kingdom Comes. So that is also out there. So, I mean, my so I am on um, on Facebook as Tosi Relaki Official. That's my page, but Tosi Relaki is my personal page. Instagram, I'm there as Tosi Relaki Official. Yeah, Twitter, to see you're lucky as well. Thank you. That's where you can get my songs. And, yeah. Okay. In other words, the songs are available in all social platforms. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Or even in our studio, we keep playing the song over and over uh -huh. and over again. 
honestly. Thank so every so weekend, my Saturday and Sunday, the song is going to be um is going to be played alongside mm -hmm. with other gospel song on our studio. Even mm -hmm. after that, yeah. the song is going to be on the studio. We keep playing it over and over and over again mm -hmm. by the grace of God. He has been winning souls mm -hmm. and it will continue to mm -hmm. win souls unto God in mm -hmm. the mighty name of Jesus. So Amen. every minute we play your song by the grace Thank of you. God. Continue to Thank glorify you. God through it in the name of Jesus. So tonight Amen. as well, if you are fortunate, you can join us. If you are free, you can join us tonight on uh, I think by 11 p.m. to 12 a.m. Okay. So um, we we'll definitely play some songs tonight, and we we'll definitely okay. play it along with it by the grace of oh, God. Thank you. So this song we we'll definitely keep it in the studio. We we'll keep using it to glorify God, to win souls okay. unto the name of the Lord in the name of Jesus. And shortly before we go today on this program, Minister Tosin, who would you like to appreciate out there? Everybody, everybody that has been there, given me a, a like, even if it's just a little like, I appreciate it. Comments, shares, support, prayers, just even listening to the song, you know, I, I'm being blessed by it. I want to appreciate all of you. I want to say thank you for, you know, for supporting, for actually liking what we do because if you people don't like it there's nobody we want to minister to if you're not being blessed so you know and the fact that you're feeding back to 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 me to say this song blessed me this song has blessed me that is also encouraging me so thank you for your encouragement thank you for your like and your support i want to say thank you to my father the lord god of heaven and earth the king of kings and the lord of lords because without him as i said earlier I am nothing. I am not. I am no one. You know, he has made somebody who is nothing. He has made it in, me into something. So for him, to, for that, I will be eternally grateful. You know, even till eternity. Um, I want to thank God for my family, my friends, everybody close and, and far. And I just want to say thank you all for, for for your support and for always being there. God bless you all. Thank you. Thank you um, across the nation radio. Wow, you have blessed me so much for bringing me on this program today. Minister Tammy, you're such an amazing, since we met back in um, Sweden, you have been an amazing, amazing person to me. You know, so I really appreciate you as well. I appreciate you. I appreciate Kingdom Radio 94.9 as well, always supportive of my mm. ministry as well. I appreciate everybody yeah. behind the scene of these two radio stations. I love you all. God bless you. Oh, bless you, man of God. We appreciate the grace Almighty upon, the, upon your life. And His grace will continue to be sufficient for you Amen. and your soul in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you for joining us on this program today. I really Amen. appreciate you. And I hope if I invite you some other time, you definitely <laughs> no, I, I will be there. On Thank this program. <laughs> I would love to be there. Thank, Thank you, you so much. much. <laughs> Thank you for joining Thank us you. today. We love you so much. We love your music. Like God I said, you. your music is going to be on GN Gospel Jam and Weekend Gospel Jam every Saturday yeah, and Sunday yeah. by the grace of God. We keep playing it Thank over God. and over in the name of Jesus. If we continue to resource unto the name of the Lord in Amen. the name of Jesus. Amen. God bless you, of God. Thank you for joining us today. Thank Have you. a wonderful Thank day you. and regards to the family. Thank you and God Bye. bless you too. Bless you. Yeah, it's been a wonderful time with Minister Tosi Oyelake. Thanks to everyone that have joined us on this program today. Thanks to AP, AP Radio UK. Thanks to Kingdom Radio 94.9 FM. Thank you for always being there for us. Thanks to everyone that have joined us today on this platform. I don't take it for granted. Your presence on this program means a lot to me. I appreciate everyone around this studio with us today. God bless you. Thanks to everyone that are working behind the scenes to make this program a glorious and a wholesome moment. Lord bless you abundantly in the name of Jesus. Please do join us tonight on ATN Radio Gospel Jam Live. We definitely play some interesting, glorious, inspirational gospel songs that will transform life, that will change life, that will bring glory to God Almighty by 11 p.m. tonight. Join us on ATN Radio Gospel Jam Live. We will play, you will definitely be blessed through them in the name of Jesus. Thank you all. We appreciate your presence on this program. So we come your way and leave you with song of Holy Spirit. May it bless your soul in the name of Jesus. Bye for now. <laughs>